At ASU's downtown campus, there are plenty of places to stay active, but according to Taylor Bell, nothing beats the intramural football field. I really enjoyed it. It was my first year at ASU, so it gave me a chance to meet people, and I've played football before, kind of, a little bit. I played powder puff from my high school, rocked it out, so it gave me another chance to get back on the field. Taylor isn't the only one excited for intramural football. Sophomores Jordan Rodrigue and Jordan Sanchez can't wait to get back on the gridiron. Rodrigue, who plays quarterback for her team, had a great time last season. Oh my gosh, flag football was so much fun last year, um, except for on the day I broke my finger. And um, I don't know, we had a really good team and it was really, really fun. It's such an adrenaline rush just going out there and throwing the ball around. For Sanchez, Rodrigue's favorite target, the competition kept her wanting more. In high school, I grew up playing sports regardless, so having that competition again, was, like, it kept my adrenaline up and made me like, really want to play hard, especially when you're playing with boys, you kind of have a lot to compete with. Moving past Correct, I asked the girls their opinion on an all-girl flag football league. Ooh, that's hard to say because girls are pretty ferocious and they pull a hair a lot. But I'd be down for an all-girls league. I think we'd be able to beat some guys up. I'm so down for an all-girls flag football league. I think a lot of girls maybe not like to play with co-ed because they feel we're playing with boys. It's a lot of like pressure on us, but I feel if it's all girls, that way we have fun out there and it's easy going and we're all at the same level. Rodrigue in particular jumped at the idea and even offered an invitation to her fellow female athletes. I would be so open to an all-girl flag football league. That'd be so much fun, and uh, I'm now recruiting. So whoever wants to be on my team, hit me up. For JMC 305, I'm Marcel Louis-Jacques.